Hello, everyone. Today, let's demonstrate how to update my blog on my Zyro website. First, this blog is created with the help of Word Hero AI, and then SEO is optimized through the similar Content Pro tool. From the interface, we click the pen like blog icon to enter the corresponding blog writing page. Here we can fill in and edit the title, meta description, URL, and so on. The representative image is generated by default, and I will replace it later. I have made a list of blog categories, and I can choose one of them accordingly. You can simply drag and drop a text editing element into a section. There are 12 grids in total. I usually align them in the middle, leaving two spaces on each side of the left and right. When there are pictures, sometimes they can be flexibly adjusted according to the needs. Other elements are similar operations. Drag and drop design and grid alignment are important features of Zyro's simplified site building skills. From a practical point of view, it is better to make a region for a single H2, so as to facilitate subsequent processing, and then there will be no disorder between various elements. The creation is also very simple. You can directly click duplicate to add an identical area and then make corresponding modifications. What I demonstrate here is a framework of the whole article. Sometimes, some links can be inserted in this place to directly jump to the corresponding content area, section, which will be reserved for the subsequent videos of Zyro operation and SEO optimization. There are more details for demonstration and explanation. Then I will directly put the intro part of the document in front. You deliberately see that this content area can be moved up and down by clicking the arrow icon. Then you can see that by clicking on the corresponding text element, we can select the corresponding text for bold, italic, bulleted, numbered punctuation statements, adding links, and other editing operations. Special attention should be paid to the selection of subtitles, H2, and text. For drag and drop text elements, the first line is H2, 36px, by default, and the subsequent line is set according to body paragraph 2, 16px. If you need to make changes, you can change them manually. Here I will briefly demonstrate the copy and paste of the first paragraph of text. You can see that you need to drag appropriately, otherwise part of the content may be hidden. However, it is not appropriate to leave too much blank. Generally, a row of the blank grid can be left in different sections. In the follow-up, copy and paste the different parts of the copy one by one. I will show it here in the form of a quick release. Here are two points. 1. The background color can be customized. The global hue needs to be preset. I am more minimalist, so I choose a white and gray background. 2. I will temporarily change some information during uploading, which is a process of inspiration. This is also different from the general AI tool writers. Instead of copying the text output by AI, I add my own creativity and verify the data and facts. For example, in the last paragraph of my final thoughts, I wrote it myself. Maybe this is not perfect content, not SEO, but I often use this strategy to make my blog more humanized. Finally, it is about the processing of pictures. Since this is a how to type guide copy, I will make a mind map as the picture and feature picture of the article. The picture can be set here. It is best to fill in the alt attribute text to improve the SEO effect. 
If necessary, this image can also be set to click to jump to other pages or activate the file download feature. After the change, we can change the status of the blog from draft to public. But this is not enough. We have to click on the update website tab in the upper right corner. Please remember that this step is required for any website update accomplishment. If the update is successful, we will be prompted that we have updated the website. Then we can click to view it. I can see the actual effect of the full text. If it needs to be adjusted, I can update it immediately. For example, I think we can add an area to recommend more content. So I went back to the editor. And I carefully selected the copy of the same category to display at the bottom of the article. The above is all the operations of updating the blog page of the Xyro website. It can be seen that the settings are very simple and clear, and the basic requirements of SEO can also be met. If you need faster collection, you can log into the background of Google Search Console and submit this link to apply for collection. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to get more relevant content updates.